Hello, and welcome to the Cryptocurrency News Channel. Today, we're going to talk about why VeChain chain might just take over uh, Walmart USA. And this does come on the heels of news last night when uh, we actually learned that IBM's blockchain division almost pretty much no longer exists. And I think uh, their blockchain division obviously manages stuff like Food Trust, which is a direct competitor to VeChain's VeChain system. But if IBM just basically fired their entire blockchain division, which they did, and they're basically their lead blockchain guy has been allocated to another place within the company, that means IBM's blockchain division, which includes Food Trust, has pretty much folded. And they said they didn't meet their sales expectations by 90%. So they're allocating all their resources, the ones they didn't fire anyways, to um, other parts of IBM that are much, much more profitable, which means no one's gonna be working on it and they might not even support it anymore. So basically, I would say that uh, big clients like Walmart don't really want to use a product that's no longer being worked on anymore and improved. And we know that VeChain's program is con constantly being improved and constantly expanding. And I know there are other big U.S. Uh, logistics blockchain firms like Track or uh, Origin Trail that's on there. But I think VeChain does have an inside, uh, inside scoop on this because they do all also work with Walmart China. And Walmart China is quickly integrating. Now, don't get me wrong. Walmart China and Walmart USA are not the same thing. Walmart USA is much bigger. But aside from that, for these big companies, the different divisions, different regional divisions of these companies almost operate like different companies. So just because one area is using VeChain doesn't mean the other area has to use VeChain. But however, I'm sure they, at the corporate level, um, you know, when they're talking about in Bentonville, Arkansas, they're like, hey, it works for our Chinese division over there. Why don't we just use the same thing? Because we have some expertise in this and we can we have some expertise in this already and we know that the system works. So I think there's a vote of confidence there because they already do use it in another region. But that doesn't necessarily mean they're going to use it. So that's very, very good news for VeChain. Um, definitely, I would say uh, IBM's downfall and food trust, maybe food trust with it is very good for VeChain because I don't know if there, how many ready-made solutions there are. I know like people are talking about tracking with Cardano or whatever, that's not ready because um, Cardano really hasn't launched their project yet. And we already have the IoT, the setup and everything there. Plus we have many successful use cases with VeChain that actually show Walmart uh, USA. Um, I think with the Biden administration, there won't be really the uh, such, um, animosity with uh, Chinese companies. Well, VeChain's not really Chinese, it's Singaporean, but they have a lot of Chinese executives. I don't think there won't be as much, I don't think there'll be as much animosity. I think it'll be easier for VeChain to actually get inside some of these US corporations. Plus, VeChain already has um, partnerships with RFID chips manufacturers or like makers like uh, Avery Dennison, which should smooth over the transition. Plus, I'm pretty sure PwC would love to get this project with Walmart uh, USA as well. If Walmart.USA would announce, I think that could possibly shoot VeChain to 10 cents just on the hype. Might wanna take some profits when that actually happens, uh, unless they get the VTHO burn up really fast. But remember, it took Walmart China a year and a half between the signing and when they actually got a lot of projects online. I think Walmart USA will have a similar amount of time. So if they did actually sign it, let's just say by April or something, I don't think it's actually going to be that quick, but if they did sign it by April, you might not actually see much action from Walmart.USA until the second half of 2022. So please keep that in mind that these integrations do take a long time, but I do think there is a possibility since the IBM blockchain division has basically folded at this point um, that VeChain could actually take over logistics for Walmart USA. So that is the news for today. Let me know what you think, like, and subscribe, and hit that bell notifications button. Thank you and have a nice day.